And hey, well, this is Francisco from One Sure Doctor Phone. And in this video, I'm going to show you three different methods of backing up your contacts from your iPhone with iTunes and even without iTunes. I know these are all going to be pretty simple solutions, reliable methods, of course, and I'm very excited to share them with you. Now let's go ahead and dive right in. Generally speaking, uh, we can't back up our iPhone using iTunes. Now, backing up with iTunes isn't necessarily the best option because the contacts backed up cannot be accessed individually or restored selectively. You would still be able to get them back, but this would be collectively, so do keep that into consideration. So not only would you be getting back all of your contacts, but because you would have to do a full system backup as a result, then you would also have to pretty much refresh your iPhone in that sense. However, here are the steps. So just go ahead and open Open up iTunes and then go ahead and plug in your iPhone to your computer and then your iPhone is automatically going to be detected by iTunes and then from here just go ahead and click on the device tab locate summary and click on the backup now button and iTunes is going to back up all of your data from your phone and now this is going to take quite a while since this is going to be a full system backup which means that everything on your phone is going to be backed up onto iTunes which could certainly take a while especially depending on how much data you have hence why these are also recovered collectively and now moving on from iTunes we do have an option that does allow for selective backups that is going to be through our own doctor phone software and selective backups is a means of backing up only the contacts that you need even when you have a list of contacts like an entire list of contacts so you would be able to pick which ones you you would want to get back or which ones you you would want to be able to back up in case of anything and with doctor phone software has saved a lot of people when they end up encountering a problem where their iPhones are formatted or when they lose their phones for instance so step number one is going to be to install Dr. Phone on your computer and then go ahead and connect your iPhone right away to your computer and then select phone backup after launching Dr. Phone from the tools. And at this stage, this is going to allow you to initiate the actual contact backup and then select the contacts among all supported file types and hit backup and voila, the backup is done for you. Note that you can also back up iMessages, Facebook messages, photos, messages, etc. and just so much more than that. So congratulations, you have finally backed up your iPhone contacts, but you do need to save them on your PC. And Dr. Phone provides an opportunity for you to do exactly that. So you can save it as a .html, .bcard, or .csv formats, just depending on what format is most convenient to you. So simply click on export to PC and save it in the format of your choice. And the advantage of using this method is that it is generally easier and faster to back up and retrieve as well as a very reliable than the vast majority of other methods out there that we have tested in the past, which is why I definitely recommend that you go with, with Dr. Phone and this method, especially since you do have many options here. And once that's done, you're pretty much good to go from there. I'm backing up iPhone contact with iCloud does allow you to do everything on your iPhone, but it takes a lot of time to, to complete the backup process and you cannot access the backed up contacts. So go ahead and tap on settings on your iPhone and then hit on iCloud. Out. and turn on your Wi-Fi and enter your iCloud account details and then the iCloud screen pops up as shown above click on contacts and then merge click on storage and backup as shown below and then select iCloud backup and then click on backup now and the backup begins now uh, but the process may take some time to complete considering that it is doing a pretty extensive backup and since you're doing it more so over the cloud rather than through a cable it is just going to take longer especially depending on how many contacts you are backing up but once that's finally done you're pretty much good to go from there and that's pretty much it those have been three methods of backing up your contacts from iPhone, whether you use iTunes or choose not to. Go ahead and leave a like if you like this video and comment your questions down below. And don't forget to subscribe for more content just like this. So now, until next time, enjoy.